Apple left so much space inside the Mac Mini M1, and we have been having a blast doing all sorts of stuff. We have converted the M1 to be able to run from 12 volts DC. We've even installed an internal battery. Before we begin, please consider subscribing, sharing, and liking our videos. This tell us we are doing something right. For today's upgrade hack, we are going to reuse the same Mac Mini M1 from a prior video where we installed an internal battery. But this time we're going to try hacking in an internal USB port. What can you do with an internal USB port? Let's find out. To get right to the point, we've removed everything in preparation for the removal of the motherboard. You'll see some leftover items from our last hack, so if you're curious, check out our prior videos. Before we do anything here are some criteria that we wanted to establish. 1. It must not be destructive, meaning that it can be undone without any permanent changes. 2. It must not be visible externally. 3. It must be all contained inside. Let's see if we can do it. Now to remove the back cover. This is probably the hardest part, finding the correct connections. Through the magic of video editing we've spared you some of the pain of watching us find the correct pins. We also used a USB extension to help us find the right solder points and also it'll be used for our internal USB port. What am I getting myself into? The tiny solder pads are so small. If you notice, I was constantly checking to see if I've soldered to the right pin.
Wow! That was not easy. Now to test to make sure I didn't short anything. To prevent the wires from moving around, I'm going to hot glue the wires. Time for reassembly. Now this was the tricky part. Finding the best way to route the USB cable. After trying different ways, I found this way to work best. Now to plug in our MikeGyver USB memory stick, then reassemble. The moment of truth. And there you go. Please keep in mind that the external USB port that we tethered to will no longer work if you are using the internal USB port. What else can we do with an internal USB port? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Join us next time as we try something else.